Hello, beautiful soul. Welcome to Peaceland Haven. I'm your guide, Natalie Brown. In today's guided song meditation to the lyrics of the Christmas song made popular by Nat King Cole, we are going to explore gratitude together. Now, due to copyright reasons, I won't be playing the music during this meditation, but I have linked a rendition that I recorded of this song some years ago if you'd like to listen to it. We will be focusing on the words in the song today. Before we begin, please find a quiet space where you will feel comfortable. This could be in a seated position with a tall spine, legs crossed or planted on the floor. Also, totally feel free to do this meditation lying down. The most important thing is for you to feel as comfortable as possible. Are you ready? Let's begin. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Jack Frost nipping at your nose. Yuletide carols being sung by a choir and folks dressed up like Eskimos. Everybody knows a turkey and some mistletoe help to make the season bright. Tiny tots with their eyes all aglow will find it hard to sleep tonight. They know that Santa's on his way. He's loaded lots of toys and goodies on his sleigh. And every mother's child is going to spy to see if reindeer really know how to fly. And so I'm offering this simple phrase to kids from 1 to 92. Although it's been said many times, many ways, Merry Christmas to you. And so I'm offering this simple phrase to kids from 1 to 92. Although it's been said many times, many ways, Merry Christmas to you. This song always reminds me to pay attention to the little things around the holiday season. Sometimes, for some of us, the holidays can be a difficult time full of triggers. I have found it helpful to focus on really small things like a pretty lighted Christmas tree, or the sparkle that comes from tinsel. I find such delight in seeing the joy on kids' faces at the magic that the holidays brings them. It's so much fun to watch them. I appreciate, too, that some humans try a bit harder to be kind and giving during this season. In my own life, I have found this time of year difficult, and it can be easy to focus on the struggles with family, being far away from those we love, the feeling of lack or feelings of frustration at the year ending too soon. <laughs> I think it's really healthy to acknowledge those feelings in ourselves. They are there. Listen to those feelings. But I have found it really healthy and even fun to take note of those little things I see, hear, or experience during this time. And as I have gotten older, I try to focus on those things and have the experience of gratitude for those things. Practicing gratitude can really help with your overall mindset. And notice I said practice because it really is just that an attitude that you develop through practice. So today, I'd like to explore gratitude with you. Are you ready? So I'd like you to take a moment and bring your hands into prayer position. Bring them to the center of your chest. Take a deep breath in and exhale slowly. Take some time to think about the people the places, and the things you have gratitude for. Bring those to your mind and heart and hold them there with loving tenderness. You can release your hands whenever that feels comfortable for you, or you can do this meditation with your hands in prayer position if that feels good for you. 
Let's begin this practice of gratitude by just noticing something simple that you're experiencing right now. It could be the sight of pretty holiday decorations, or perhaps there is snow gently falling outside your window. Perhaps it's feeling a warm cup of your favorite warm beverage in your hands. Feeling the heat from your warm fireplace on your skin, maybe. Or, or maybe it's the experience of comfort from the chair that you're sitting in, or the simple wonder of pausing in the middle of your busy life to engage with this practice right now in this moment. Choosing one simple thing to notice in this moment, allow it to fully absorb into your experience and let appreciation and gratitude arise and fill your body and your mind. Appreciation for this one simple moment right now. Reflect on someone whom you don't know very well, who has supported your experience today in some way. It could be a bus driver, the person who stacked groceries in the grocery store, or the author of the book you're reading right now, or maybe the programmer of your favorite app. Just reflect on someone whom you don't really know who has supported you in some way. Allow yourself to feel how you benefited from the gift of their work, allowing yourself to feel some appreciation and gratitude towards this person. Now, thinking about the tools that you use that support your work in your life. Tools like your computer, your books, equipment, or even the buildings that you occupy. Considering all that was needed for their creation. Knowing how much these things have benefited you for your work and survival. Just feeling some appreciation and gratitude that you have access to these tools. And now, feeling gratitude for the people who you work and live with. Perhaps thinking of a particular person whose work or effort directly supports your work in life. Appreciating their contribution and their good intention. Saying in your mind to them, thank you. Thank you. Now, thinking about the holiday season, thinking about the beauty and the small things mentioned in the song I recited earlier. Think about all the joy that the season can have. Think about the weather where you are. Is it snowy or sunny? Thinking about spending time with people we love, participating in interesting conversations, Decorating our spaces with festive things like garlands, lights, pretty trees, and pretty objects that sparkle when light shines on them. Gathering to share brightly wrapped gifts with colorful bows. Preparing and eating favorite foods together. Whatever your holiday looks like, I want you to picture in your mind one of your favorite aspects of the season and say thank you out loud for this beautiful aspect. Go ahead and do that right now. Now, bring to mind someone who you really care about. Someone who makes your heart sing in some way. Just picture them in your mind. And think about what this person means to you. What you appreciate about them. Who they are. And what you've experienced together and also about the impact that they've had on your life. And as you imagine them, notice what feelings you're experiencing. What sensations do you detect in your body? Especially pay attention to the sensations and feelings you have in the area around your heart. And let yourself express gratitude towards them thanking them for being who they are and for their presence in your life. And imagine them receiving your gratitude, truly feeling it. And now bringing to mind something in particular that you're grateful for today, something that made a difference to you or that you especially noticed. 
Perhaps it was a smile from someone on the street, someone's kind words or selfless action. Feeling the appreciation and gratitude you have for its presence in your day. And as you bring these things to mind for what you're grateful for, allow yourself to rest in this experience of gratitude. Just stay there for a minute. When you cultivate this practice of gratitude, you may even find yourself able to be grateful for difficult or unpleasant experiences. If it feels safe for you, bring to mind an experience in your life that might be a little challenging, one for which you'd like to be able to express thanks for challenging you in some way, offering your appreciation. Thank this challenge for what it may offer you. Is it knowledge? inner growth, acceptance, or maybe understanding. Thank this challenge and then release the thought. Now expanding this feeling of gratitude for your body, gratitude for your mind, and gratitude for the simple fact of being alive at this moment. And finally, Appreciate the opportunity to pause and experience this very practice of gratitude for all that you brought to mind during this practice, for all the countless gifts in your life. Just say thank you to all the people, to all that is around you and part of you, for all that you've experienced in your life, for all of this. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And now allowing the sense of gratitude to fill you completely as you breathe in and breathe out and settling your mind on your breath here and now, fully alive and present in this moment. Finish with a full deep breath in and a long, slow breath out and gently and slowly Open your eyes, returning your awareness to where you are. If you'd like to extend this practice, cultivate the habit of thinking about something that you feel grateful for every morning right when you wake up. If it helps, feel free to write about it in a journal. You might also try expressing appreciation today to a person for whom you feel very grateful, simply saying to them, thank you. I'd like you to wrap your arms around yourself and thank yourself for taking the time to take care of you and practicing being grateful today. Whatever holiday you celebrate at this time of year, or even if you don't, gratitude is universal and such a beautiful thing to observe and practice. I'm really grateful for you. Thank you for spending time with me today. Make sure you're subscribed and have notifications turned on to get notified of my next video, where we'll be having a wonderful short yoga nidra sleep meditation. 
Until we meet again, take care of your soul, love yourself, know you are very loved, and show love to others. Until next time, my friends.